In this video, I'll guide you through how to fix a blurry video in CapCut with a few steps to improve clarity and add some effects. Let's begin. First, open CapCut and start by creating a new project. Tap on New Project and then select the video you want to improve. Import it into the timeline so we can start making adjustments. With your video selected in the timeline, go to the top right corner of the screen and tap Adjust. Here, you'll see a range of options for tweaking the video settings. Begin by adjusting settings like brightness and contrast to make the video clearer. Experiment with these parameters until your video starts looking sharp and defined. Next, let's add an effect. Go to the Effects tab and search for the black and white sketch effect. Apply it to your video and adjust the intensity until you get a balance that doesn't overpower the footage. This effect will enhance the video's details, making it look sharper. Now, search for the blur effect in the Effects tab and apply it to your video. Adjust the blur intensity to your liking. This effect can help smooth out any remaining rough areas or motion issues. Once you're happy with the settings and effects applied so far, go ahead and export the video by tapping the Export button. Wait for the export process to finish before continuing. After exporting, reopen your project and tap on the black and white sketch effect you previously applied. Delete this effect. Now, look up the neon effect in the Effects tab and apply it to your video. Adjust the settings for the neon effect to create a glowing outline around details in the video, which will add clarity and make it stand out. Once you've set up the neon effect, export the video again by tapping on the export button. Let the export complete and then return to your project. Now, delete all effects from the timeline. Import both exported versions of the video, the one with the black and white sketch effect and the one with the neon effect. Select the black and white sketch version first, change its blending mode to burn and set the opacity to around 45%. This blending will bring out details without overwhelming the video. Next, select the video with the neon effect. Change its blending mode to multiply and set its opacity to 45%. Combining these two modes will enhance clarity and detail, making the video look significantly better than before. And that's it. You've successfully fixed the blurry video. You can now export the final result with the new adjustments.